Break news. Welcome to Afri's Concept TV. Here is the headline. If we catch you, you will regret your action against our land. IPOB warns Igbo traditional leaders. If we catch you, you will regret your action against our land. IPOB warns Igbo traditional leaders. To my dear listeners, from wherever you're listening from, ensure you like, subscribe, and share. Thank you. Now the details. The indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, have issued a stern warning to traditional rulers in the southeast region of Nigeria, accusing them of collecting money from terrorist headmen in exchange for allowing them to operate freely in their communities. According to IPOP spokesman, Ima Powerful, the group has received information from Fulani Atmen themselves, confirming that they have been paying traditional rulers and community leaders before entering and staying in various communities for extended periods, sometimes up to three, four, or even five months. Powerful stated that IPOB and its security outfit, the Eastern Security Network ESN, will not tolerate this kind of criminal activity and have vowed to hold these traditional rulers accountable. He warned that any traditional ruler found to be involved in this dirty deal will be treated as a saboteur and their actions will be seen as endangering the lives of the people in the region. IPOB ESN will not tolerate any traditional ruler collecting money from terrorist leader, from the terrorist others. If you know that you are a traditional ruler in Igbo land, who has made a deal or entered into a business contract to allocate land for Fulani settlement. You would better stop it now and know that you are endangering lives, including your own, powerful declared. The IPOP spokesman further revealed that the group is aware that some state governors in the southeast are also involved in this illicit arrangement with the terrorist headmen. He warned that IPOB ESN operatives will be closely monitoring the activities of all traditional leaders in Biafra land, and those found to be colluding with the enemy will be treated as traitors. IPOB ESN will not spear any traditional ruler or committee leader who is involved in this kind of criminal activity. Know that if we catch you, you will regret your actions against our land. From this moment on, IPOB ESN will be monitoring all the traditional leaders in Biafra land Powerful said. We are not begging you to stop. But we are informing you that your life is in danger because ESN will treat you as working for our enemies against the interest of our land and our people. You may want to consider moving yourself into exile. IPOB, ESN won't spare you. IPOB ESN operatives are watching all nooks and crannies of Biafra land because our traditional rulers have failed the people of Biafra like the Southeast politicians did. 
we must overcome their sabotage. They can use any strategy to blackmail IPOP or try to stop ESN from making headway. But God Almighty, Chuku Kike Abiyama, sanctioned that we must come and take over and restore Biafra nation. The IPOP statement comes at a time when the security situation in the southeast region has been a major concern with reports of increased attacks, kidnappings, and killings by suspected Fulani headmen. The group's accusation of traditional rulers being complicit in these atrocities has further heightened tensions in the region. IPOB has long been at the forefront of the struggle for the restoration of the Biafran state and the group security outfit. ESN has been actively engaged in protecting the region from the perceived Fulani threat. This latest allegation against traditional rulers is seen as a significant escalation in the group's fight to safeguard the lives and properties of the people of Biafra land. So my dear listeners, now we've come to the end of our today's news. And now before I go, I I want to I want to say that for the love of money, we shouldn't risk our lives. We know what this um the what this nation connotes now, that there are enemies amidst us. So because of the love of money. And because of what we want to eat, we shouldn't kill our future. You know what Biafran is fighting for? Even though that's, that is not what they should be fighting for. But if the government are doing things that are right, they would have...